Disney, though, of Pastry is that TSM have been crazy discoordinated for the beginning of the l tournament. These two champions, Gragas and Bard, have the most potential. Battling for Guardians it. just waits in a brush and gets really paid for that. And if they can start stacking these dragons early, the team with Azir and Senna is always going to love having Soul at the win. Manage a laning phase or start getting dope, but TSM without the coordination to Ooh. make dives. Booney, They're not play. getting anything. Nice attempt there. Flashes in, but doesn't quite connect because now flashes out. Rift Herald is still on the table. Iconic. Maybe fancying a smite steal, but lost with a big. True Shot Barrage does get the damage down. The eye goes over, but I believe TSM did get it. Indeed, Huni will pick it up. Huni can look for that Q, but it's not going to cut him up. But he misses that skill shot. Zorda also not able to land that slow. So TSM are on the objective. Who's going to collect it? Iconic low. The dragon does go over to a blaze olive. But Golden Guardian's now lost in the fight as Iconic. Locked up there by the Bard ulti. He does flash over the wall. Niles almost about to go mega as the root into the dragon pit is leaving Huni left for dead. It's Nubi that finds the play just barely over the wall. And that's first blood to a blaze olive. Second blood over to Niles as Golden Guardian. Ooh. Maybe find a third as Nubi grabs a massive hook of blaze olive. Where the double kills, he solos out the TSM jungle. And that's four straight for the Golden Guardians. Oh, baby. They try to erase Golden Guardians, and they will be winning this. I need to see what the GG response is to this, because they could lose two if Niles is bold enough to defend in, this, in their face. Yeah, Niles does want to kill his Rift Herald, but it's still two up here for TSM alongside the Herald, so Herald's just going to get that second charge in. Oh, Hooney making the play. Niles now going to get knocked back in. This time, Hooney finds a combo, but Niles hops over the head of Hooney. He's going to maybe be okay, but Lost is absolutely going to seal that kill. Does have to flash. So gets the auto down, but that could be two towers as well. Very well played by TSM in the 2v1 dive. But here's a Blaze Olive. He's 2-0 already. He's got the Leandri's finish crumbs. Don't do it. But he's the 1v4. I take everything I said. Oh, all the soldiers up, and that is a disaster. Tempered fate. Good ulti actually scoops him back in, but it's going to be a shutdown. Hooney does not die. The wrong part of the center ulti is there. Actually, the burn was enough to get the trade kill. So 1-1 oh. one one at the end of it all, but a Blaze Olive throwing away a bit of bounty gold. Okay, Golden Guardians needs to see these plays. They happen so often against Niles in the top side. TSM where I'm gonna aggro this strike. They know they need to take this. Pretty important to make sure the enemy team doesn't go up through zero. But Niles, Niles? ready for the play. Finds the wall follow up, and there's the ulti out. Wow, the hook is good and lost. Just gets obliterated by Golden Guardians. Now iconic over the side is trying to finish off the Drake. It's five v four for Golden Guardians, and that's enough. TSM are out of there. I I cannot imagine a more picture perfect play where the Find pressure in the side lands lost and power of evil will push down the bottom outer. Uh, Blaze Olive is going to answer here in the top side. So t uh, Golden Guardian, sorry, still kind of playing catch up on structures here, but winning the fight certainly finding a. Uh, Finding those picks and all 5v5s, and given that they're up on a very quick soul point here for the ocean, and Stixa is starting to unleash the Kraken on Huni there in mid lane. Although TSM pushing through once again, Niles cannot defend this on his own. So Golden Guardians a bit slow to respond to these pushes. Yeah, they no are really will build armor moving forward. It's just going to be AP, but a play onto a Blaze Olive. He yeah, has nice. flash. Yeah, pretty low though. Has to get out, but the shield is not enough. Just barely. I think the last sphere yeah, killed him. They're going to check way too late. The orb, I think, actually went down. Yeah, he did use it, but that's Baron gone. TSM sneak it at 22 and, and a half. keeping them out. But TSM are going to move in there. Huni actually into the pit. Oh. Now going to get the initiation starter. Finds two there, but Niles is going to counter engage in. And now into the back of the pit goes Speaker trying to kill off Iconic, but the shield boost keeping him alive for so long as Blazov takes down Huni. The dragon goes over, but Huni steals it amongst the chaos, and Speaker is going to fall down. So Golden Guardian. Dragon, oh. because the Olaf went straight in by himself. But he went for a 1v1 against Graves. Nobody was there to follow up despite Nar having done a good job zoning in. And then M-Tank is uh, getting Huni in there, but Huni, uh, Niles maybe can get out. He's going to have to hop out, but the Kask, I think, actually maybe helped him. Does get a bit of help back there, and now Golden Guardian is looking for the counter plays. Power of Evil finds the stun, gets the kill with it as a result, and somehow Speaker lives. They can push themselves far enough ahead that it's going to be tough for Golden Guardians to find a way back in. And plays like this are going to help Newbie getting trashed by wow. that damage. My goodness, Dustblade, Essence Reaver, and a TMN on top as Loss just wipes out Newbie off the rift. Hey, should be good for that Ravenous Hydra next, and this is just a lot of damage out of this Ezra. You never saw the build before, so it's hard to know how much damage he does, but just know that it hurts just as it always has. So and main engage for Golden Guardians twice already. Really nice there for Loss, just soloing the Drake while TSM are busy tying up Golden Guardians in mid. That will prompt them to go mid and at least try and open up the center of the map, which they will do. But TSM now on the offensive, ulti out of Soda almost clips them, but Huni finds Iconic there at the end of it all. But the Lions are actually going to save him. Stixay now going to turn it back around, and he's unleashing hell onto Huni. 
Sword Art also in a little bit of trouble, but Stunland's in under 6 The heal's still coming out, but he does have a flash and will be forced to commit it. Lost again with the burst damage. Is going to force Dixie to run back. So Golden Guardians, no one dies, but they're going to lose that exchange as TP's coming in for TSM. It's not over again. yet. Lines it up. Newbie going to get the flavor. But Huni finds a double belly bop, and the ult from Stixay is not going to save anyone as TSM with finally... Less turrets to defend with the Syndra that also is going to have a death cap, so it's getting... The lead they have now, which is actually pretty significant. You know, 3,000-ish gold. And the Golden Guardian still fighting well. Huh? That's a good pluck on the start up, but he is not going to live. I take it all back as the Blaze Olive is able to finish it up. Ah. The scene, the first, the second, third, and fourth crime... I guess we'll call it five there as Niles is going to get a sphere dropped on his head. Hooney's going to find the combination and Speaker's going to collect the kill. It's like, I don't know what's happening in the this lane of plays. <laughs> like, why is it always here? And Golden Guardians members continue to flash. Like this Baron should not have happened. This should not be a Baron push. This Baron is about to expire. It's only one more push, 25 seconds on it. But because Nar is dead, the push is actually going to be fairly effective. But Blaze Olive is not here on time, so he doesn't have soldiers ready to go. And now TSM get a free inhibitor when it should have been another team fight at Dragon. Yeah, and that's going to make fighting for this Dragon very, very challenging. They'll engage on their own terms. It's only Niles that's thinking about looking. So if I'm Golden Guardians, oh, oh I'm no. not Golden Guardians. I'm dead. That wasn't even <laughs> ult. I thought Power of Evil ulted. Didn't even need to. I think that was Ezreal plus the Syndra. Just the basic poke there as Niles is trying to dive into the backside, but Senna already dead. As Speaker just dives out of the tower. Niles is, of course, going to die in the onslaught as this looks like an ace here out of TSM. Iconic is going to get Hooney. A Blaze Olive is going to die, and that's going to be your Bud Light ace. As the last one from GGS falls and TSM are going to take a victory lap to the enemy Nexus. Yep, they're going to go straight to the Nexus. They should end the game right here, and it's a really nice team fight out of them. They see the opportunity, instantly capitalize, and don't hesitate to seal this one. They want to be out of this one. It's 33 minutes in, so it's a good game time, but it didn't feel like it, so the faster they can be out of this one and thinking about the next game, the better for TSM. All right, certainly some promise for Golden Guardians. The TSM, perhaps getting uh, more and more put together as they do take the victory over Golden Guardians. I think expect